Number 10. The Airbus Transparent Plane The Airbus Transparent Aircraft, which has a tentative completion date of 2050, aims to revolutionize the experience of flying more than the actual mechanics of flying. The entire craft is transparent, which may be intimidating to some individuals but will ultimately be thrilling, similar to skydiving, hopefully. The glass door that serves as a biometric scanner is where passengers check in, and the seats will automorph to fit your body shape. The only time a fear of flying will truly help prevent an accident is if the seats are built to absorb body heat from the passengers, which will then be used to help power the aircraft. Finally, Charles Champion, the head of engineering for Airbus, claims that see-through ceilings enable passengers to relax and experience the panorama in which they are flying. His complete lecture is seen in the video down below. Number 9. The Green Airways Flying Saucer Although none of us anticipate building a flying saucer in our lifetimes, aerospace experts are still imagining how we might do it in the future. The flying saucer is the pinnacle of science fiction. At the Delft University of Technology, Etnel Stratzma is experimenting with novel techniques for creating environmentally friendly airplanes with the goal of ideally reducing carbon emissions by 50% when compared to conventional commercial aircraft. Number 8. The Skylon Surface to Orbit Plane The design of modern spacecraft is now well known. Massive engines are utilized for takeoff and then dispersed. As the ship approaches the lower gravity of the outer atmosphere, smaller engines take their place. It functions, but, to put it mildly, it isn't very effective. The development of single-stage-to-orbit reusable launch vehicles, or SSTORLVs, which are spacecraft that resemble normal aircraft rather than the huge shuttle design we've been using for so long, has become a focus of research in recent years. Enter the Skylon, an SSTORLV that will be capable of more than 200 launches and re-entries and is almost ready for production. The aircraft's design, which is 90% funded by private businesses, will use a single multi-purpose engine for both flying stages. It will function like a jet engine to extract oxygen from the atmosphere, and it will switch to an onboard fuel source to conserve weight, space, and money when traveling through space. Number 7. The X-51A Wave Rider Another historical analogy is that early 20th century steamship travelers across the Atlantic might anticipate spending at least three days at sea. The journey takes modern aircraft around seven or eight hours. The X-51A Wave Rider, which can theoretically go from one side of the Atlantic to the other in a little under an hour, is another option. The Boeing-built X-51 has a top speed of Mach 6, or roughly 4,000 miles per hour. For sustained flight at or above Mach 5, or five times the speed of sound, it recently set a record. In order to transport this plane, or any weapons produced from its technology, to anywhere within a 450-mile radius, the Wave Rider must maintain sustained flight at hypersonic, or Mach 5 Plus, speeds for at least 300 seconds. This is equivalent to the time it took you to read this entry. The Wave Rider has so far undergone three formal tests, with mainly successful flights that inevitably ended in a crashland in the Pacific. The Wave Rider got its name because it literally flies on its own shockwaves. Number 6. The Aeroscraft Dirigible Airship Airships have not received much attention from the general public since the 1937 Hindenburg explosion, but they appear to be making a comeback as we search for more environmentally friendly and fuel-efficient forms of transportation, this time without hydrogen. The Aeroscraft Dirigible Airship, which is being developed by the Worldwide Aeros Corporation, is currently the front runner. The airship measures just over an acre in size and weighs 400 tons. Helium and the jet engines that are employed for takeoff and landing give it its buoyancy. Number 5. Flying V The so-called Flying V is yet another extremely futuristic aircraft. It's noteworthy to note that the designers of this prototype aircraft picture passengers sitting in the wings. It's unclear whether the jetliners from Fallout 4 served as inspiration for the design, but either way, it's a creative idea. This system should drastically cut fuel use over longer distances, similar to Airbus Maverick. This is so that it will both lighten the craft's overall weight and enhance its aerodynamics. Number 4. Progress Eagle The Progress Eagle unmistakably looks like a futuristic aircraft. This, in his opinion, is the type of airliner that will be used in the future. According to Viles, it has a very distinctive design and can accommodate 800 passengers on three decks. Six hydrogen fuel engines, integrated solar panels, and rear electric wind generators make the aircraft environmentally friendly as well. Apparently, Viles, by making the aircraft lighter, 
materials including carbon fiber, graphene, ceramic, aluminum, titanium, and a shape memory alloy would boost efficiency. If we do say so ourselves, it also has a really great appearance. Number 3 Lockheed Martin Sky Tug Hybrid Airship Similar to the Aerocraft, this hybrid airship is being developed by Lockheed Martin and will be able to lift off vertically before using rear-facing propellers to generate thrust. Its distinctive feature is that, like an airplane wing, it is aerodynamically constructed to offer added lift when going ahead. The tops of wings are curved such that as air passes over them, it must move quicker there, creating less air pressure above the wing than below, thus pushing the wing upward. The Sky Tug and its predecessor, the P-791, employ the same idea, but their bulbous frames are covered entirely. Number 2. The DARPA, Boeing Disc Rotor These days, DARPA seems to be working behind the scenes on every technological endeavor, and air travel is no exception. This entry resembles a futuristic helicopter more than the fixed wing or airship entries in this competition. Similar to a helicopter, the DARPA and Boeing-designed disc rotor will take off and land using rotating blades. Nevertheless, once in the air, the blades will constrict into a sizable disc on top of the ship, acting as the wings. Jet engines are then mounted on the sides to propel the flight forward. Due to its hybrid construction, the aircraft will be able to take off and land vertically and fly at speeds that are generally unattainable for helicopters. Number 1. The Icon A5 Although while it's amazing to consider the potential of air travel in the future, it's likely that some of the items on this list won't be implemented. So here is a futuristic aircraft that will probably be produced in large quantities by the middle of 2013. The Icon A5, a two-person amphibious plane with foldable wings and a cockpit that resembles nothing more than an SUV's cabin. With a price tag of $139,000, this plane is really less expensive than a Porsche 911 Turbo while being explicitly pitched as a toy for the wealthy, although parachutes cost extra. If anything, this is the mythical flying car's most realistic evolutionary path, as science fiction has always predicted it to be. The A5's automated wings could theoretically fold up on its back, allowing it to land on a road with only a few wheels as you simply coast it into your garage. 